When somebody asks me why here instead of someplace else, I say, first of all, just look around you. That's a hint. This was the opportunity of a lifetime to work on one of the largest grassland restoration projects in the world. I have a long history with coming down here in Patagonia. I first came in 1961. I thought, gee, oh, this is an incredible place. I wonder if anybody ever thought about the possibilities of conservation here. Patagonia National Park is a project we conceived almost 12 years ago now to buy Estancia Valle Chacobuco, see that the grasslands and forests begin to restore themselves and unite that with two national reserves that are contiguous to the valley. We want for people to get out and fall in love because you will not protect something unless you love it. Unless you go out into these hills and the wind is in your face and things hurt, it's raining, it stings your face, that's when you fall in love. When we have this park finished, when our part is finished, and the government is willing to accept the donation of the property that Conservación Patagonica has and all the infrastructure, we are giving it all away to the state. Personally, I can hear my biological clock ticking very loudly in my ears. <laughs> we have, uh, you know, a lot of projects to, to do and, and to finish before we're finished. We'd like to say goodbye to the world, having had a fundamental hand in creating national parks. They are the gold standard of conservation. They represent a good form of social equity. They belong to everyone. This is gonna be a great day. They're gonna run up the Chilean flag with a lot of pride and joy. I've been around a lot of national parks in a lot of countries, and this is gonna be one of the great ones.